The following is a production of Cary TV, the town of Cary's government access channel. Hi, I'm Don France, Cary Town Council Member for District B. And I'm Lori Bush, I'm the at-large council member, and this is Carry Matters. We created this program to help keep you informed about issues that council members, like us, are working on for our community. And I am so glad you could join me, Lori, for this fun-filled episode. We're going to be talking about our new downtown fountain. It is awesome, so cool, and in case you haven't seen it, I mean, I don't know how you could not see it, but if you haven't seen it, the new downtown park and fountain are located at the corner of Academy Street and Kildare Farm Road, right directly across from the Cary Art Center. And it's open and boy, does it look good. It sure does. And thank goodness it finished just in time for Springs so folks can actually get out and enjoy it and are they ever. We've never seen so many folks out and about in downtown Cary before, and it's fantastic. And, and I really love and or I enjoy seeing how so many different people enjoy the fountain in so many different ways. Uh, there's been people out there uh, just simply reading a book by it and taking it all in. There's been people playing on the lawn with their kids, uh, people taking selfies, obviously. Maybe a few of us maybe, have taken a, a selfie. Uh, and then people, I've even met one guy who was flying a drone around it and taking video. It is so cool. It is. It's, it's awesome. And in fact, I saw a couple that just posted on Facebook some pictures that they took downtown in front of the fountain. We knew that would happen. Absolutely. We knew it would be so beautiful that people would want a picture. And it's nice for people to be out there and enjoying it and having fun. But we do have to be careful that some folks' fun doesn't make other folks miserable. Unfortunately, like every other park in Cary, there are a few basic rules that folks need to adhere to, and some of them are specific to the fountain. Like what, Lori? Oh, I don't know, Dawn. <laughs> well, first and foremost, as tempting as it may be on a hot day, the fountain is not a swimming pool. So no swimming in it. Don's not going to be bringing his swimming trunks to swim in the fountain. And we don't want anyone else to get hurt. And we also can't have anyone climbing on the fountain's pump house. That's that small structure with the green roof right next to the bocce ball court for fear, you know, they could fall off and in injure themselves. And while we do encourage folks to ride their bikes or skateboards to visit the fountain, we don't really want you riding around it like a roundabout. <laughs> don't want you riding around the fountain or on the square for those same reasons. Well, that's not terribly unreasonable. It actually sounds more like common sense, really. But I guess sometimes we do have to state the obvious. Uh, now, what about wishes? I mean, are folks still allowed to throw coins into the fountain and make a wish? Or did we ban that too? Yeah, we pretty much banned that. <laughs> 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 no, 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 no. We didn't ban wishes. We actually encouraged them. All the loose change from all of the wishes is going to be collected and we're going to take that and donate it to the Town of Cary's Relief for Recreation Scholarship Fund and it'll help all the disadvantaged children that attend Cary's summer camps. So while we can't guarantee that all those wishes, I saw you throwing those no, in there, I know, I know. are going to come true, you know, we might be able to make a kid's wish to go to summer camp. Come well, through. that's awesome. So you mean that the more wishes that folks make, then the more kids we can actually send to summer camp? You figured it out. All right. Well, get out there, folks, and start wishing. <laughs> oh, and one more thing. The town will be having an official downtown park dedication ceremony slash party, party on June 24th. Uh, this should be a lot of fun, so make sure to mark your calendars. And Oh shoot, I almost forgot. Uh, we're also going to begin planning for phase two of the downtown park very soon. So that should be very exciting as well. Uh, great things are happening in downtown Cary. Yeah, and I think that not just the fountain, but all along Academy Street and the streetscape and the benches and, oh, did I say the number one new brewery in the U.S. is there? And the did? ice cream shop. I mean, it's like all the food groups in one location. Awesome. Where else would you want to be? <laughs> Nowhere. <laughs> Nowhere. <laughs> well, that's it for this edition of Carrie Matters. Your time is important, and we hope that 
What we've shared has been valuable to you as we work to bring you closer to your government. So let us know what matters to you, and maybe next time we'll talk about it on an upcoming episode or so. Maybe uh, we will. Until then, thanks for watching Carrie Matters, and thank you for choosing to call Carrie home. Cheers. Cheers. This has been a production of Cary TV. Visit the Town of Cary's website at townofcary.org.